Hey guys, my name's Nick, and in this video, I want to teach you how to get into pretty much any four-year school in your local area from community college. I recently graduated from Temple University after doing pretty bad in high school. I never took an SAT, and my GPA was just overall really bad, but I decided to go to community college, take four classes at a time, and graduate in two and a half years. And after that, it prepared me to go to Temple. And I was able to graduate with only 50,000, or no, with only $40,000 in debt. And that's with absolutely no FAFSA or any financial help. So I really believe that doing community college for your school is the way to go because you'll make considerably more than that if you're doing the right research and you're picking the right degree. So, you might be wondering, how can I get into any four-year college that I want? Like, I went to community college for a reason, you know what I mean? Like, I didn't get into Temple during high school. I got rejected. So, a lot of schools, including the one that I went to, Monka, my old mater, they have four-year partnership schools and dual admission programs. And you might be wondering, what does dual admission mean? I'm not trying to go to two colleges at once, but that's not what this means. Dual admission programs are contracts set up between a community college and a four-year school. They allow a seamless transition between the two, and it makes it really simple for community college students to get ahead in their career and their education for a discount. So, in this example right here, you can see that on Monka's webpage, they have all of these schools listed out. There are some good names like Temple, Penn State, West Virginia, Albright. There, there's a lot of good options, and any one of these would be a great school to go to. But sometimes you might not have all the qualifications right away, but this takes away all of that. So if you can see at Temple, all you need is a 2.3 GPA, and you just need to be graduating with any one of these degrees, and you're pretty much guaranteed to be a clean junior. Uh, my experience with the dual admission was pretty much I did the dual admission, I got my bachelor's degree, or my associate's degree from Monaco, my community college. Then, when I transferred to Temple, they um, messed up my admission a little bit, but I emailed them, I talked to Joyce, my amazing advisor, and she was able to fix everything up for me. Then, I pretty much just took the standard amount of classes as a junior would take, no more, no less, and I was able to graduate my degree in accounting, concentrating in data analytics, and minoring in MIS. You can also do double majors once you transfer, but it is very seamless and it's very easy. Both the advisors at your community college and your four-year degree should be more than helpful enough. And um, if you just ask them about the dual admission program, I'm sure they'll help you. Then once you are actually looking into these schools, I personally think that you should set up meetings with the department heads and whatever major you're considering. So now I went to the Fox School of Business and I chose accounting. When really I was more passionate about MIS and maybe even computer science. And if I'd taken the time to email the head of the department, connect with them on LinkedIn, or even just have a Zoom meeting with them and say, hey, like, can, I'm a transfer student, I'm really interested in what you're doing, and I'm considering your major, can you set up a meeting? It's as simple as that, and that can really change your whole life in a way. Because you can go from something that you either hate to something you love, or something that's not paying very much to something that's paying a lot. So definitely reach out to these people, it's their job to help you out, no matter if you're a community college student, or if you're not enrolled in the college at all. Their job is to get people excited and to get them to join their programs because that, that's where their checks are coming from, these students coming in every year. And I'd say that it works out pretty well for the students. So um, just make sure you're doing the right research. And if you follow these steps, then you're almost guaranteed to get into um, a good four-year college after you're done community college. And just make sure you do this early on because there are some contingencies with having too many credits. I think at Monco, you were supposed to get it done before you were halfway done with community college, so try to talk to them within your first year, 
And if you found this video helpful, please leave a like, subscribe, and until next time, I'm out.